Hi, welcome to my cooking channel. Today we're going to make a chicken salad. This salad is creamy and very filling and slightly tangy and sweet with the fruits and the crunch from the celery and toasted almonds. You can make sandwiches or eat with the crackers for lunch or dinner or for snacking. I'm using one part of chicken breast but you have the choice of selecting rotisserie chicken or any cooked dark meat. There is a tweak in this recipe. Please stay tuned until the end of this video. I'm cooking my chicken in a stove top. Heat the pan with the one tablespoon of cooking oil. Add the chicken pieces with the desired amount of salt. Cover and cook for 10 to 12 minutes. Please make sure there's no pink inside the chicken or the internal temperature should read 165 degree Fahrenheit when the chicken is cooked. Let's make the sauce while it's cooking. You are using a little over 1 cup of plain yogurt instead of mayonnaise. Add a couple more tablespoons of yogurt if you want a thinner consistency. Now we can add 2 tablespoons of honey mustard, 1 tablespoon of lemon juice and 2 tablespoons of honey and 2 teaspoons of crushed black pepper to the yogurt. Black pepper is totally optional. Mix everything well together with a 2 tablespoons of freshly chopped dill. I prefer to use a shredded cooked chicken instead of big chunky pieces. But it is your choice to use cooked shredded or cubed chicken. Now we can add other ingredients to the yogurt mix one by one. We are adding one cup of chopped celery, half a cup of finely chopped onion and almost four cups of cooked chicken. Mix everything well together and we can do the taste test now to see whether you need more salt or sweetness. We can adjust everything according to your liking. Adding one cup of spinach is optional but I like some greens in my salad. We are adding one cup of sliced grapes to this mix. But you can use either sliced grapes or apples or you can use both. Now it is time to add our toasted crunchy almonds. Let's talk about the bread that we are going to use for the sandwich. Some use sourdough bread or toasted bread. Some of my friends use croissant. You can also eat with the crackers. I love Hawaiian bread. A slightly sweet and the right size. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Please try and enjoy and please let me know the outcome. My next few videos will be meatless meatball with eggplants and vindaloo or vindaloo recipes. I'm signing off right now and have a pleasant day.